Hey everyone, so I immediately began this episode by knocking into my mic three times in a row. So that's something that's gonna be have to gonna have to be edited out. Gonna be have to be. Yeah. Welcome back to Blue Fire. Um here we are. Apparently accidentally walking into a new area. I don't wanna do that. In fact, I want to go back and check out what the hell is going on there. Because uh, I don't think that was the end of that room. Although, it might be the case that there ain't jack shit here. In today's episode... Yeah, how about we don't do that just yet? How about we get a new emoji instead? I don't have enough. Okay, I'm missing two, so that's not it's not gonna be an issue to get. Welcome back to Blue Fire again, as I've said for the manyth time. I'm pumped up. I'm pumped up to play this game again. Uh, I kind of was slacking recording this game. I don't know why, because I I find it fun. I find this game a lot of fun actually, even though basically nobody's or not many people are really interested in this playthrough, but. I don't know, man. I think this is a this is a game to be interested in. Because who doesn't like a Souls Legend of Zelda? Oh shit! Mishmash, you know. Okay, I'm gonna have to like think real hard how to equip. Nice, better weapon. So because there are no stats in this game, um, I can just, I think I've already cleared this out. You know, I can just use my shit. And if I remember correctly, I'm pretty sure this is where we came from, right? I actually don't know. Hold on a second. Or did we come from, fuck, this is a problem. No, I think we came from here. Okay, fuck don't. Yeah, we came from here. So the question is... Which path do we want to take? I think we'll take this one. Let's go up. By the way, it's Saturday today. Yeah, I'm recording this on Saturday. Um, thing is, I was going to stream, but... Then, you know, kind of plans changed. As plans tend to do. Mainly because... We, after a long, long time... The weather was finally decent today. Which meant that I was doing... I'm liking this weapon. I'm liking the kind of whole vibe of it. Let's not get into the fart. I was just doing things, uh, I was out for a long time tonight with the dog, cause... Yeah, you know, just again, the weather was really good, Clark the fire guard has fallen, it's not every man for himself, may the holy gods protect you. Mayday. Oh, Mayday? Cool. I'm making all types of connections today. So... Okay. But that's just the thing. That's just the thing. Uh, I, I can stream on Sundays. I mean, it's not like illegal or whatever. It's just... I don't know. Sunday streams have a different vibe to them. Tunnel cross. Oh, come on. Is this how we're doing it? I always get, like, whenever I start going into, like, one of these areas... In a game where there's bl branching paths. I always immediately start wondering about the other path. I maybe should have taken that. But you know, we're not locked out of anything, I think. There's always a chance that was a stupidly risky jump. What am I doing? Okay. 
my mistake. I thought you could land on those. See, I'm actually wondering about that as well, down there. Whether that's like a proper tunnel you can go down. Stupid. You can just make it to the other side. Then what I was trying to say is I'm stupid. I'm trying to jump on a spike. Anyways, this definitely 100% looks like the way forward. Hence the reason I saved the healed. One shot these little bitches. I wonder if there I mean there has to be there have to be bosses in this game. It's just we haven't encountered one yet. Although I just checked my game time before starting and I'm literally 49 minutes in with game time. So we're not exactly like, you know, deep in the throes of this game. A lot of shit can still go down. And speaking of going down, let's go to the elevator guy. And before that, let's save because... Uh, after what happened on in episode one, I don't trust this game one bit. Rip. This is the northwest elevator. This beauty will take you to the Stoneheart City. If only Umber. Okay, he said that again. Twenty four hundred. Jesus. Fucking. You were. Pay me later, but twice the price. Fuck that. Alright then, well, I thought this guy was nice, but it turns out he's kind of an asshole. He's trying to rip us off. What sort of like fucking like extortion is that? Elegant. That was an elegant move. So yeah, I wasn't, I didn't expect to be extorted, basically. But you can't take, you you do take fall damage in this game, so we have to be very careful. Yeah, so that wasn't in my plans, honestly, today. So we need to somehow gather the required cash for this guy. 2400. I mean, and the problem is that I want that emoji, and it costs... It's not an emoji, it's an emoticon. Because an emoji is on your phone. I am making no sense today. But I want it. And that costs 200. So, and I'm fucking scratching my ear like an asshole. Um, oh man, difficult. Difficult choices. I mean, these do spawn... Hat kid smug. Just based off of the sound. Is it like flossing or what? Okay. I think that was worth 200 cash. Oh shit. But hold on then. I can't activate the thing. This thing. I can't. Like, I don't have 24k. Mmm, okay. Please don't tell me I have to farm up that much. There's no fucking way, right? They wouldn't do that to you. I mean, I could just... Like, I don't know, extort him back, but I feel like it's gonna... He's gonna come and bite me in the ass or something. Oh, but there's this path as well, which I said that this is not where we came from. Oh yeah, fuck that. We 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 have more options. Boss, this is gonna be a boss. 
Is it? Or is it just a combat arena? Yeah, it's just a combat arena. I like... I got like that big ass fucking... New magic sword. You know, these guys don't stand a chance. I mean, look at that shit. Hey, more of you can come. You're easy. And we have... Fire Charm, a charm created by the gods that holds the power to cast. We have magic. X to charge, which one is the X? This is, this is Nintendo Switch and of course, no two consoles have their button layout. Whoa, okay. That was not what I was expecting. What the hell? Strange. Interestingly, it drains your shit, but I still can't pick up more of it. Oh, oh because it's probably a consumable, right? Is it? Hmm, weird. Well, whatever. I think this can only be a good thing. Getting some magic. This is gonna be a boss. Oh, this is 100% a boss. <laughs> Holy shit. Look at this dude. Got a pose. Spirit Hunter. Well, well. What do we have here? Another dogged contender. I think you have to do that to him. Oh shit! I thought you need to like, kill him. <laughs> what do we have here? Try to find living... B I thought it was a boss. Fuck, did I just like try to kill him? Hold on a second. Whoops. Aside from shadow creatures. Yeah, I think I just tried to kill him. My bad, bro. My bad, don't worry about how I tried to just kill you. See, I traveled this land for many centuries after the dawn of shadows, and during these travels I have learned many arts. Over the years I also mastered the art of hunting spirits. Listen closely, small one. How would you like to master the art of spirit hunting? Hell yeah! Never mind about, yeah, that killing thing. Oh well. Felt the desire to possess other souls in you. Now my uh, young apprentice, I should... Ex Is this like, um evil guy during your travels you will come across spirits many survivors will sell or give you spirits they have found themselves each spirit spirit has a special power to activate that power you must equip the spirit at any fire shrine okay this is like the magic system right void souls Uh, I don't think so. Like, I need... Hmm. Hmm. He, he's doing the hmm a lot. Alright. This is definitely the magic system. Um... Which I'm okay with. Yeah, I'm just gonna loot your house if you're don't if you don't mind. Man, I'm like so desperate for a boss fight. I'm like willing to kill anything. Like you better not but listen, don't tell me that wasn't the boss like entrance. Like If I picture in my mind Boss? Fucking hell. Why does my fucking... Okay, this is annoying. Why does my PC go down into sleep mode when I'm recording? And it's only with this game. OBS. 
It did not used to do that before. Oh fuck. I definitely can't get across there, no way. But it's not gonna cause me to drop frame. L last episode there was an annoying thing that... Um, for some reason OBS dropped a frame or two with recording, which it doesn't usually do. And uh, that's pretty annoying because it fucks up. It fucks up a lot of things. Okay. They're all locked. I'm gonna save. And here is the honest truth. Hell yeah. I mean, why not level up, right? I think I'm gonna have to uh, like put off the elevator guy as in put off having to pay maybe later I can just kill him because I feel like I'm fucking myself but by doing this but I'm not sure because my feeling is that I'm just gonna keep pushing him along and then at one point there's gonna be like uh, an area where you can't actually pass without having to interact with him or paying him and then I'm gonna fucking like tear my hair out so we might as well collect as much money as we can oh you're still good Still going strong. I feel like I'm getting better at the combat system, if you can say that. I mean, this ain't the most complicated combat system in the world. I gotta get through this shit again. But... Still. There is improvement, I feel. Okay, that leads there. Okay. Mystery solved. Talk about overshooting. And the frust frustrating? I can't even talk. Frustrating thing is I'm not that far away from. Well, actually, 24k, that's still far away. So I don't mind that I did all this, like, I didn't make progress, technically, even if I didn't really. Sure. Um, I mean, okay, sure, keep in mind that you will have to pay me. I think I won't have to pay him. I don't think I'll have to pay him. This would be a dick mechanic if they did this. If you have some extra time in stone, feel free, feel free to pay me a visit there. Alright, let's go. New area, new enemies, new adventures or something like that. Something akin to that. To use some fancy wording here. Nice. So it's still in the sewer. But like a different a different vibe of sewer. I'm liking the feel of this place. I this game kinda has like this this stupid word because oh shit. Where the hell did it put me? Are you fucking kidding me? No, but I want to be upstairs. Shit. I fell down here somewhere where I'm... Not like not meant to be, but still. 
It somehow like saved my status as being down here. But oh come on. It's like the instinct, you know. At least he's not climbing like fucking demon souls. Which I don't know why I made as a reference because this game has nothing to do with demon souls. Oh god, could these things be any more slippery? The fucking pipe physics are on point, which doesn't bode well for me. And that's how you save yourself from fall damage. I've played Dishonored. This was the primo tactic in Dishonored, you know, you could survive basically any fall by using your teleport. Fuck! Whoops. By using your... <laughs> okay. Alright, I'm gonna have to heal. Then like legit kill. The, there's probably nothing on that pipe except for that one point of essence or whatever that thing is. But at this point... At this point getting it is like personal. Yeah, this literally gives me one extra cash. I should probably collect that because that's like the shit you use to level up. I mean, the only thing I can think of is that this is leading me. Yep, it is. Oh, come on. God, this is nerve-wracking. It really, it genuinely is slippery, and that makes it kind of difficult. Oh shit! Kind of difficult to climb on sometimes. Man, like the age-old, you know, kind of saying that. It's mad difficult to make a, a 3D platformer. Holds true. I think 3D platformers are difficult to get right. I mean, this game gets it. I mean, the jumping and the movement feels solid. But still, just as like a... Like a base thing, like a base statement. What the shit? I feel that it is like very tricky to what the hell is that ancient relic to make a, a good 3d platformer what the shit is this I can't like use it or anything see but then again I am once again curious about that other path. Oh, this is looking nice. This is looking real nice. I mean, I think I need to... At this point, I am obligated to hit up that checkpoint. Interesting that these things work like fucking CCTV cameras. You can see like from the different angles. Oh, hello NPCs. Good evening, young one, Ari. I've been waiting for you. They refer to me as Ari the Crafter. You may simply call me Ari. For centuries my family has dedicated itself to the art of making tunics and swords. Cool. This is gonna be the armor smith. I don't know why I did this. The Needle of Fate has spoken to me. Quite some time ago it foresaw our encounter. I don't quite know who you are, nor am I aware of your of your role in this land. What my part is in your journey. Your part is to make weapons. Shot tail by, I like that. Okay, so you can die your shit. Rainbow. 
Blue, violet, gray. Hmm. Thank you. I'm sure, thank you. I'm just gonna raid your house. Because I'm an asshole. Probably foresaw that as well. This little shit is gonna come in here and go up to my bedroom. See, I honestly thought that this game was gonna be more, like, empty. It's cool that there's, like, legit NPCs and shit around. That's the old book. So this is gonna be some fetch quest. I can already tell. My fetch quest senses are, are, are tingling. That's, that's a thousand? Holy shit. Still though, I feel like this is a central bonfire, so I'd be stupid not to not to hit this one up. I'm missing one. All right, let's go kill something. Just a little question. How the fuck do I get back up there? Where this dude was. So that was like a bunch of bats. Probably through here. Oh yeah, this is this is the one. What up? Oh, this guy. Still owe you some money, but whatever. Knew it. 4800 Bye. Traitor. Heresy. Heresy. Got a nice crib there. What up, MTV Cribs? Oh, this is gonna be... There, there's gonna be some, like, slingshot mechanic, right? Is it gonna be activated and they're gonna, like, blast us through this area? Listen, I'm, like, I'm, like, one step ahead. Wolfgang, flute player, you start on me, didn't you see I was practicing my music? Wolfgang. Sorry, I'm like going through this. They said it was home to a god called Nuos. You think that's really true? You see, I come from the Rust Village. Since the awful incident with Paul Lale, I decided to become a solo player. I I have no fucking clue what's going on with these guys. They're kind of cute looking, but yeah. So this is like a huge area. Um, we need to like really work out where to go. I mean, I guess just forward, but there's a lot of books here. Listen, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna go with my instinct, but I specifically know that I missed a couple of areas which I'm a little bit sour about. Hello. I bet you're yep, you're gonna need the books. My name is Mork. Gork and Mork. Morcos family. Collect books and objects that harness the knowledge hidden within. As a matter of fact, to celebrate our new acquaintance, bring me five books, I will give you a valuable reward. I don't have five. What do you sell? Possess books. Book. Perform a spin attack after a dash. Increases the spin attack's height. Doubles the amount of collected ore. These are good. These are like perks or something. 
Hmm. Oh, we can sell shit to him. Ho okay. Okay, okay, okay. Now things change a bit. Because I can now buy restores health when killing enemies, doubles the amount of collected ore. Mm, this one sounds kind of nice. Fuck it. The question is, do we, do you need to equip these? Or do they just come all natural? They probably just stack, hopefully. And there haven't been any enemies here so far, so... It's gonna be difficult for me to find out. Although... Looking at the time now, I think... I think the time has come to slowly start wrapping up the third, right? This is the third episode of Blue Fire. We are going to go through this door. That's gonna be the last thing. As always guys, if you did enjoy this video, uh, make sure to give it a like. Hope you guys are enjoying this playthrough because Oh, and it brings you back here. Because I'm enjoying this game actually quite a bit. I'm gonna need to like figure out how this all links together. Oh! Damn. Okay, well I completely missed that. That's how you loop around. Cool, that makes a lot more sense now. Then, the last thing is gonna be... We're gonna position ourselves here. Because we will see what's... I don't think I can make it to the other side there. <laughs> I don't think so. And you need probably like some mega awesome... Fuck! Okay, double dash. I just jumped into the acid. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up here because I feel like... This, this like little zone here... Yeah, I, my hands are not in the face cam. I've been like really trying to kill myself here. I think I'm going to wrap it up here instead. Thank you guys very much for watching. Again, take care. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications as always. See you, take care, and peace out.